Hi everyone, welcome to Amateur Effects Reviews. I'm Theo. Today I'm playing the Proco Rat 2. Uh, for those of you who don't know what it is, I'm sure you will do at this stage. It's a distortion pedal. It's um, commonly referred to as a distortion pedal. To me, there's a lot of stuff that overlaps it with fuzz, personally. Um, there's a lot of famous users of the rat, but on bass, the one that really sticks out to me as a famous rat user is Chris Novoselic from Nirvana. He used to use a rat quite a lot, I believe. Um, yeah, not, not going to go into too much detail about it. It's a relatively small sort of pedal enclosure. You've got an input and output, power supply, and then distortion, filter, and volume. Now, the filter control is a high cut. Uh, and it cuts more as you turn it up. So it's basically like a normal tone control, but just works backwards. So today my signal chain is my Squire Precision Bass. It's going into my Boss RC3 Loop Station and my Tuner, going into the rack, going into my Tech 21 VT Bass, which is providing some Ampeg style amp and cabinet simulation. I will turn off the VT Bass in a bit and go into the more radar, which is gonna just be a high cut and a low cut. So it's a high pass filter, at 30 hertz and a high, uh, low pass filter at 5 kilohertz. I'll give you some of my clean tone first. So, as you could hear there, the rat kind of, I, I really like it on the low gain setting there. I'm finding that with guitar as well, I'm enjoying the low gain setting. Um, on bass, as the distortion goes up, quickly you can hear that everything kind of just gets a bit too, a bit too messy for my liking. There's no definition and the high cut 
sort of filter doesn't really help bringing the highs back in that much but the low gain stuff you're getting some really nice grindy stuff there so I, I'm, I'm enjoying that so in that last section i was using a pick so let me use my fingers this time see how that changes things <laughs> Okay, so let's move from the VT base to the Moor radar, which is providing that low cut, high cut. Okay, so that's the Proco Rat 2. Uh, I like it. I definitely prefer the low gain settings. In fact, I feel that it goes from a sort of low gain sweet spot into all out distortion really quickly. In fact, maybe a little too quickly. Now, I know there is, there's the, I think it's called the Roots mod. 
um, that does a few things, but also makes pedal more low gain. Um, the Zero Threat Serpent though also has has that mod, it's optional. And it's nice because obviously with it being low gain, you've got more of that range of that low gain sort of setting uh, that you really fine tune what you want out of it. Um, in terms of low end retention, I think it cuts base. I don't think it would be the end of the world um, with the amount of bass it cuts, but I do feel like it does, or at the very least, I think it cuts bass and I think it boosts the top end quite a lot. So, but even with the filter down, or, or up I should say, it, it, you, the, those lowest frequencies are going to get cut, in my opinion. Um, however, I do like it. As I said, love those low gain sounds. Um, I'm going to go shoot my demo for the Zero Fret Serpent now. And then you can listen to both videos and see how it compares when the Serpent video is out. Anyway, hope you enjoy this video. Take care of yourselves. If you're on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. There's a link in the description. Have a great week. Bye.